Ladies and gentlemen, I am now home for my Money in the Bank 2022 trip, and this, this was my trip experience. is brought to you by SeatGeek. So if you guys are looking for tickets for any event in the entire world, doesn't even have to be wrestling related, use SeatGeek, use code Hodge, and save yourself $20 off of your order. First time orders only, so if you used SeatGeek before, just make a new account and use my code anyway. I forget about the trip experience for a moment. Ladies and gentlemen, I have a surprise vlog extra for you guys. Stairs, but this is pretty nice. It is hot out here. This is like the bridge overlook. I'm Let's go down there on the side of this cliff. So it's extremely hard to see from right here, but that is the Hoover Dam right there. All right, so yeah, I'm out here at the Hoover Dam now. I thought I would come out before the flight and see what it was like out here. I've drove by it on this on this highway that all these cars are flying by. But that actually never stopped. I'm walking on the bridge right now. The Hoover Dam's over there. A crazy view here, and it's really, really cool. You have to say it was definitely worth the hour drive. Ford Mustang, okay? Hoover Dam, okay? There's the bridge we were just on. That's supposed to be tilted like that. That just looks creepy. I think it's made like that, but still, that's just terrifying looking. Now, how in the hell did they manage that? They have somehow put an elevator in the side of a mountain. There is like a lot, a lot, a lot of people up here. Pretty cool view out here. And you have to say, welcome to Arizona. I'm now in a different state, just driving over the dam. King's gonna turn around and go back home. My trip is over. And now is the part I start crying. <laughs> There is the official sign, I believe, the Hoover Dam. Through another state, welcome back to Nevada. All right, I'm back in Nevada, on the way to the airport. All right, it's Allegiant Stadium, where Mind the was supposed to be, but they kind of screwed us out of that one. Just a four hour flight later and now I am back home here in Tennessee in the Brandon Hunt Studios here. Uh, so today we're going to be uh, going over the trip experience, how everything went and everything. So first off, let me show you everything I got on my trip and we can go through what I did. Uh, so Monday, the main course, I went to the show. I got a souvenir cup, got the shirt of course I'm wearing now, looks like that on the back. I got the hat, which actually I had to wear on the airplane because I didn't have room in my bag for it. I also got this thing, which... I first got it, I'm like, oh, it's a plastic poker chip. How cool a plastic poker chip. And then I'm like, this thing's like squeaky. And then I realized it comes apart. And inside of that is a metal poker chip. So I'm like, hell yeah. It's really cool and really well made. Now going on to the non-wrestling things. E.T. Fresh Jerky, of course. Uh, in the Money Bank vlog, I went out to the E.T. Highway. I got some E.T. Fresh Jerky. I ate the, I ate the jerky. Now, I guess I kind of got confused. Too a little thinking for me to figure out what E.T. Fresh Jerky uh, from Area 51 men. I thought, oh, we're eating aliens now. That's what we resorted to. But it turns out, no, aliens abduct cows. They make jerky with the cows. It's jerky made by the aliens, not with the aliens. So I got a little confused on that one. Uh, also, I got an extraterrestrial highway sticker, which I'm probably gonna put a magnetic back on. And the rest are magnets because magnets are something I love to collect because they're, they're small, they're easy to transport, and pretty much everywhere has them. So I got uh, the state mag magnets, California and Nevada, those two states I went to. I collect all the, the same style magnets so they all fit together perfectly. They should come pretty close anyway to fitting together. Uh, then the other magnets, I got a Los Angeles, California little, little license plate magnet. I got a Route 66 California magnet. 
And I looked everywhere for a, one a magnet that just said Disneyland on it, which turned out to be an impossible task. The closest I got was with some Disney characters on it and it just says California. So I'll count that as a win, I guess. So that's actually what I picked up on the trip as for souvenirs, because as you guys know, I tried to pack very light. I tried just to pack everything into one backpack. So with clothes and all, this is the only souvenirs I was able to bring back for my week-long trip. So if you guys uh, don't know what I did, check out all the vlogs, because there's three different vlogs on the channel. Uh, first day was crazy. Went to Vegas, had a good time there. The first day was the first vlog was actually three days, uh, so it was crazy. I went through California and all that. Uh, second vlog, I went to Dis uh, Disneyland in California, and then I came back to, to to Las Vegas, and then I went out to ET Highway. I did all kinds of crazy stuff on this trip. Seriously, guys, if you haven't checked out these vlogs, definitely go do that because I put a lot of hard work into these. Uh, there's a lot of drone uh, footage in that, which we can talk about for a moment. Uh, drone. I do have a drone. I've had a drone for months, but I really haven't had a chance to fly it. I, 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 got, I got frustrated at myself, and I'm like, Brandon, what the hell? We paid like $700 for this freaking drone, and we're not using it. we got to use it. So I go out there, and I'm like, I want to use it every chance I get. So I flew it in Death Valley, which was kind of dangerous. I flew it uh, over the Pacific Ocean in California. Where else did I fly? I flew it up there at the Hollywood sign, which was crazy. I took some really crazy locations for this. I flew it out next to the extraterrestrial highway, which was the most windy place I've ever been. And then on the drone screen, I was getting this high wind warning, land immediately before we lose the drone. So that was scary. But everything went well. I got some really cool drone footage with that. And hopefully you guys noticed that in the vlog. It's like, hey, Brandon, Brandon's getting pretty good with the drone. Hopefully you guys noticed that. Uh, but yeah, it was a really fun trip. Uh, Disneyland uh, was really fun. Um, I, I had to ride rides. I, I didn't think I was going to be able to ride. The wait, wait times at Disneyland were not bad at all. They were actually a lot less than the Disney World I go to all the time in Florida. Uh, so that's uh, that, that was a nice surprise. Uh, what, what, what else could I mention here? The beach was nice. Santa Monica Pier looks like it's been renovated a little bit. That was really nice. Uh, Las Vegas, I had a good time out there. Um, I don't really do too much in Vegas. I actually won 80 bucks at the casino. I'll count that as a win. That was the only game I got to. And I won 80 bucks. I'm like, hell yeah, I won in a claw machine little, little ball game thing. That was cool if you guys saw that in the vlog. Uh, but overall, the, 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 this, this trip was a lot of fun. I had a great time. Uh, money in the bank, I just wish it was the bigger show. I wish it was in the Allegiant Stadium like it was originally supposed to be. Uh, but that just didn't happen, and that's just the way it goes sometimes. But overall, I had a wonderful time, and hopefully you guys really enjoyed the content I made out there because that was what the main point of these trips are. Of course, they're fun for me to do, but I, I, the, the main goal is to make the most entertaining pieces of content I can possibly make. And I, I think as I travel more and I do more things and I get better with camera gear and drones and stuff, I feel like they're getting better each time. Hopefully, you guys agree with that. I am your king after all. I have to be on top. I have to show you guys what it's like to be the best. I don't really consider myself the best, but you know, you, you guys gave me the name King of Vlog stuff, so I'm just trying to live up to the nickname you guys gave me. Uh, but ladies and gentlemen, hopefully you guys really enjoyed the trip. This is it. Uh, this is uh, the end of the Money Maker. But I will be going to SummerSlam, however. As you guys know, I'll be at SummerSlam in Nashville, Tennessee. It's not going to be a week-long extravaganza like this one was. It's just going to be like a day or maybe two days. Uh, so it's not going to be all extravagant. But nonetheless, I will be doing some really, really cool content out there. Hopefully I have time to fly the drone, do some cool filmmaking shots and stuff like that for you guys out there. And hopefully you guys are excited for the SummerSlam vlog. And hopefully you guys enjoy the three vlogs I did out there kind of more than three like technically it's three different videos posted on the channel but each day has more like each vlog has more than one day in it so hopefully you guys really really enjoyed what i did out there let me know what you thought in the comment section down below but thank you guys so much for watching this video thank you guys so much for watching the vlogs thank you guys so much for subscribing and enjoying all the content i appreciate everyone so much but i am your king of vlog style brandon hodge and i will see you guys in the next video